Hello everyone, sorry I'm voice acting because my voice sounds horrible in this clip. Today I will be doing a washing tutorial and I'll be washing Atlas because uh, she just went to the lake and her fur is very rough now, so we'll just wash her. You'll need a toothbrush, hot water, and a beanie boot of your choice. So yeah, let's get started. Alright, so I just realized that my voice also sounds terrible in this, so I'll also be voice overing but what you'll want to do is submerge the beanie boo in water and leave it there for at least a couple minutes so yeah all right it's been a couple minutes so this is what she looks like and what you'll want to do is get your toothbrush put soap on it and scrub <laughs> Once you're completely done scrubbing your Beanie Boo, as you can see it's very soapy, you'll want to submerge the Beanie Boo back in the water and try to get all that soap off because if you don't get all of it out, the Beanie Boo will become moldy and it's just very gross to see in your Beanie Boo collection. So try to get most of the soap um, off and rinse it out to make sure all the water's out. That could also lead to mold happening, so I definitely recommend using this because if you don't wash, clean out your Beanie Boos, then they'll most likely get mold. Once you're completely done scrubbing and washing your Beanie Boo, you'll want to drain all that soapy water. Make sure it's all gone by the time you're done because it could get soap back into the Beanie Boo if you do put it in the sink again. So try your hardest to drain all the soap out. Once all the soapy water is drained, you'll want to turn the sink onto hot again, and you'll just want to put your Beanie Boo into the hot water and just try to get out all the rest of the soap and make sure it's really hot. Try not to touch it because I did burn my hands a couple of times. You can probably see in the clips. Um, if you do get it on your hand, just be very careful because in a few seconds, you can probably see me burning myself. Yeah. Here's just a time lapse of me trying to get all the soap out of the Beanie Boo. I really didn't want to record all this, but I did for some odd reason. After you're done rinsing off the Beanie Boo, you'll just want to rinse all the extra water out of the Beanie Boo and try to get all of it because this is the last step of the process of washing your Beanie Boo. So you'll want to try and get all that soap out. When you're done rinsing out your Beanie Boo, you'll want to get a towel and you'll just want to scrub your Beanie Boo as hard as you can with that towel because, like I said, you don't want it to lead to mold because that will happen. I've had mold in my Beanie Boos before, so please do this step because it's very, very important in the process, so please. So when the Beanie Boo is all dry now, you'll probably want to uh, leave it by a window with sunlight can hit and it can dry properly and after you're done you'll want to dry the beanie boo so yeah thanks for watching <laughs>